Alright, so I possibly have a couple of new subscribers, and I wanted to put out a warning um, before y'all say anything. Because, God, this is hard to explain. I am a targeted individual. And as such, anybody who is openly supportive of me is putting themselves in danger. I'm not exaggerating when I say that. If you come to my comments and you are supportive of me, they will attack you. They will find you. They will go after your job. They will go after your children. They will do anything they have to do to remove you from my life. And if you step into that, there is nothing I can do to protect you. Nothing. Nothing. I can't save myself. They are going to harass and belittle and dehumanize me until I take my last breath. And everybody who comes to help me is just going to fall victim to their trap. I had this happen just recently. A friend of mine who went to school with me tried to be brave and said some things on my Facebook that she shouldn't have said. And they went after her. They went after her job. And she came crying, pleading with me to make them stop, and I couldn't. The only thing I could do was tell her to turn against me. The most heartless action anybody could take. And so now that friend has to talk bad about me, has to go to their channels and say things about me just to protect herself. Because they're relentless. And all they want is the win. The emotional win over their victim, which is me. I am a Trasdia, and I am a victim of targeted harassment, and it will not end until I'm dead. And while I, I appreciate anybody who is here to support me, I don't want anybody to get hurt. I've already had to see friends attacked because they cared about me. They sent my therapist death threats. They've contacted my doctors, my landlord. I don't want anybody else in danger. And I can't stop myself from crying out and luring people in to save me. So that I feel guilty for everything that happens to everybody else and I'm not the one doing it. I can't stop myself from reacting. I can't stop myself from being the way I am. And they can't stop themselves from hurting me. But you who just joined, hopefully you will be able to stop yourselves from saying anything that will put you on a list, that will get you hurt. It's the last thing I want is for anybody else to be involved in this. And people will say, well, why don't I just leave? For one, I have no place else to go. This is all I know. I don't have anybody in real life. And for two, I leave and they put another victim in my spot. As long as I'm filling this spot... There's no room for a new victim for them. Their next victim doesn't even know that any day they could be chosen to have their life completely turned upside down. But if I'm here being beaten down every day, their attention is focused on that and not on their next victim. And somebody else who's mentally ill and struggling 
they get to live another day without this harassment because I'm taking it for them. I don't know how long I'll be able to hold that spot. But if I leave before I stop the people who are beating and I allow them to just keep taking other people down, how am I better than them? They've told me it's my fault my siblings were abused after I moved out because I didn't stop my father. So then, if I leave this situation, I'm also responsible for not stopping them. I'm responsible for everybody else who is being abused by them right now because I'm not stopping them. Even though there's nothing I can do to stop them. It's an extremely hopeless situation. But please don't say anything that'll get yourselves attacked. Please. I'm not allowed to have encouragement. Just like I'm not allowed to have anything. I'm not allowed to progress. If my medication starts making me feel better, they'll start attacking me and upping the abuse to override that. I am not allowed to have any support or happiness. So don't try to bring any to me. Because they'll just hurt you for it. <laughs>